Hello everyone, this is Addicted1 with, with a tutorial on how to install Starburst 1.9. Alright, just so everyone knows, make sure you do a backup, an Android backup, and if you run into any issues, this should help you resolve them. Um, this is going to be followed up by a 1.9.5 flash, just so everybody sees how it, easily it is done. Alright guys, that just shows the version that I'm running, and here we go, we're going to make sure we have the proper ROMs on our SD card, and there you see I have 1.8, 1.9, and 1.95 already, so I can install them, um, and if I run into any issues, there are, they are on my SD card. Alright everyone, I'll try and post links for 1.8 but I know 1.9 and 1.95 should be available so uh, if you can look in the comments for the video and I'll have them post it if I can so we're gonna go back and we're gonna do uh, uh, everything three times just like it says in the forum for the starburst ROM what we have to do is go under mounts and format the system three times then we have to do a wipe data factory reset three times. What we then we, we do next is to wipe the cache partition three times, followed by the Dalvik cache three times. So we're going to start with the format system. We're going to do that three times. Okay, so that was three times for the format system. Now we're going to do a wipe uh, factory reset, wipe data factory reset. Um, then we're going to do that three times, okay? As you can see, everything's running pretty smooth, everything's fairly quick. Okay, so that looks like three times. We're going to go back to the main screen and then we're going to do the cache partition. We're going to wipe the cache three times. Okay, so that was three times. Now we're going to go back. We're going to go under Advanced. And that's where we're going to wipe the Davik part uh, cache, which is the second option down. And this one should be quick as well. Okay, so that was three times. Now we're all set. Now we're going to go back to the main screen and we're going to go under install zip from SD card. That's where we're going to find our ROMs to install. And there you go. It's a little hard to focus, but it's the one that I have highlighted.
Okay, so then we're going to do 1.9, and I'll try to do a follow-up video for 1.95, which is fairly simple. There it is, 1.9. I'm going to go ahead and select it, and then we're going to uh, go all the way to the bottom and hit yes, and we'll get it started. There you go, it's opening up the packages, installing the package, and we'll get a good to go sign in a minute. There we go, here we go. Alright, it's been installed. So now we're just going to go ahead and go back to the main screen and we'll do a reboot system and get into the ROM. Let it run for a minute. Make sure we update our profile through the system updates. And then we can go ahead and flash back. And you should be all set. So everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video. I said leave comments. I'll try and help. If not, check out the XDA forum. For the Starburst ROM for the Samsung Galaxy S2 Epic Touch.